Glossary. A braidable strip. A strip of material in the compressor housing of some axial flow gas turbine engines. The tip of the compressor blade touches the abradable strip, and wears, or abrads a groove in it. This groove ensures the minimum tip clearance. Abradable tip, compressor blade tip. The tip of some axial flow compressor blades constructed so that it will abrad, or wear away, upon contact with the compressor housing, which ensures the minimum tip clearance between the blade and the housing. Absolute pressure. Pressure referenced from zero pressure or vacuum. AC. Alternating current. Electrical current in which the electrons continually change their rate of flow, and periodically reverse their direction. ACC. Active clearance control. A system for controlling the clearance between tips of the compressor and turbine blades and the case of high-performance turbofan engines. When the engine is operating at maximum power, the blade tip clearance should be minimum, and the ACC system sprays cool fan discharge air over the outside of the engine case. This causes the case to shrink enough to decrease the tip clearance. For flight conditions that do not require such close clearance, the cooling air is turned off, and the case expands to its normal dimensions. The control of the ACC system is done by the FADEC or Full Authority Digital Electronic Control. Acceleration The amount the velocity of an object is increased by a force during each second it is acted upon by that force. Acceleration is usually measured and expressed in terms of feet per second. Per second, FPS squared. Accessory end The end of the reciprocating engine on which many of the accessories are mounted. Also, called the anti-propeller end. Accumulator A hydraulic component that stores a non-compressible fluid, such as oil, under pressure. An accumulator has two compartments separated by a flexible or movable partition with one compartment containing compressed air. When oil is pumped into the other compartment, the partition moves over, further compressing the air which holds pressure on the oil. AD, ashless dispersant, oil. A mineral-based lubricating oil used in reciprocating engines. This oil does not contain any metallic ash-forming additives, but has additives that disperse the contaminants and hold them in suspension until they can be removed by filters. IDC, air data computer. An electronic computer in an aircraft that senses peak at pressure, static pressure, and total air temperature. It produces an indication of altitude, indicated airspeed, true airspeed, and Mach number. The output of ADC is usable by any of the engine or flight control computers. ADI. Anti-detonation injection system. A system used with some large reciprocating engines in which a mixture of water and alcohol is sprayed into the engine with the fuel when operating at extremely high power. The fuel-air mixture is leaned to allow the engine to develop its maximum power and the ADI fluid absorbs excessive heat when it vaporizes. Adiabatic change. A physical change that takes place within a material in which heat energy is neither added to the material, nor taken away. If a container of gas is compressed, with no heat energy added to or taken from it, the gas will become hotter. Its temperature will rise. Aerodrome. The name given by drive. Samuel Langley to the flying machines built under his supervision between the years of 1891 and 1903. G1. Aromatic propeller. A patented variable pitch propeller that has counterweights around the blade shanks and the blades angled back from the hub to increase the effects of aerodynamic and centrifugal twisting forces. This propeller automatically maintains a relatively constant RPM for any throttle setting. Aft fan engine. A turbofan engine with the fan mounted behind the compressor section. The blades of an aft fan are normally extensions of the free turbine blades. Afterburner. A component in the exhaust system of a turbojet or turbofan engine used to increase the thrust for takeoff and for special flight conditions. Since much of the air passing through a gas turbine engine is used only for cooling, it still contains a great deal of oxygen. Fuel is sprayed into the hot, oxygen-rich exhaust in the afterburner, where it is ignited and burned to produce additional thrust. Air bleed. Carburetor component. A small hole in the fuel passage between the float bowl and the discharge nozzle of a float carburetor. Air drawn into the liquid fuel through the air bleed breaks the fuel up into an emulsion, making it easy to atomize and vaporize. Air cooling. The removal of unwanted heat from an aircraft engine by transferring the heat directly into the air flowing over the engine components. Air fuel mixture ratio. The ratio of the weight of the air to that of the fuel in the mixture fed into the cylinders of an engine. Air impingement starter. A turbine engine starter that basically consists of a nozzle that blows a stream of compressed air against the turbine blades to rotate the compressor for starting the engine. A royal separator. A component in a turbine engine lubrication system that removes the air from the scavenged oil before it is returned to the oil tank. Airworthiness directive. A regulatory notice sent out by the FAA to the registered owner of an aircraft informing him or her of the discovery of a condition that keeps the aircraft from continuing to meet its conditions for airworthiness. Also called AD notes, they are covered by Federal Aviation Regulations Part 39 Airworthiness Directives. They must be complied with within the specified time, and the fact, date, and method of compliance must be recorded in the aircraft maintenance records. All-weather spark plug. A shielded spark plug designed for high-altitude operation. The ceramic insulator is recessed into the shell to allow resilient grommet on the ignition harness to provide a watertight seal. All-weather spark plugs, also called high-altitude spark plugs, are identified by their 3-4-20 shielding threads. Alpha control range, alpha mode. The flight operating mode from takeoff through landing for a turboprop engine. 
Alpha mode includes operations from 95% to 100% of the engine's rated RPM. Altitude engine. An aircraft reciprocating engine equipped with a supercharger that allows it to maintain its rated sea level horsepower to an established higher altitude. Amateur built aircraft. Aircraft built by individuals as a hobby rather than by factories as commercial products. Amateur built or homey built aircraft do not fall under the stringent requirements imposed by the FAA on commercially built aircraft. Ambient air pressure. The pressure of the air that surrounds an object. Analog indicator. An indicator that shows the value of the parameter being measured by a number marked on a graduated dial aligned with a movable pointer. Angle of attack. The acute angle between the cord line of a propeller blade and the relative wind. The angle of attack is affected by both the engine RPM and the forward speed of the aircraft. Annual inspection. A complete inspection of the airframe and power plant required for FAA certificated aircraft operating under 14 CFR Part 91 General Operating and Flight Rules and not on one of the authorized special inspection programs. An annual inspection must be conducted every 12 calendar months, and it must be conducted by an aviation maintenance technician who holds an airframe and power plant rating, and an inspection authorization. The scope of an annual inspection is the same as that of a 100-hour inspection. Annular duct. A duct. Or passage. That surrounds an object. The annular fan discharge duct surrounds the core engine. Annular orifice. A ring-shaped orifice, normally one that surrounds another orifice. G2. Annulus. A ring or groove around the outside of a circular body or shaft or around the inside of a cylindrical hole. Annunciator panel. A panel of warning lights visible to the flight crew. The lights are identified by the name of the system they represent and are often covered with colored lenses. Red lights indicate a dangerous condition. Amber indicates a system is armed. And green indicate a safe condition. Anodizing. A hard, airtight, unbroken oxide film electrolytically deposited on an aluminum alloy surface to protect it from corrosion. Anti-icing. Prevention of the formation of ice on the surface. Anti-propeller end. The end of the reciprocating engine that does not attach to the propeller. Also called the accessory end. APC. Absolute pressure controller. APU. Auxiliary power unit. A small turbine or reciprocating engine powered generator. Hydraulic pump. And air pump. APIs are installed in the aircraft and are used to supply electrical power. Air. And hydraulic pressure. When the main engines are not running. Air amid fiber. Fiber made from an organic compound of carbon, hydrogen, oxygen, and nitrogen. It has high strength and low density. It is flexible under load, and is able to withstand impact, shock, and vibration. Kevlar is a well-known aramid fiber. Aromatic compound. A chemical compound such as toluene, xylene, and benzene that is blended with gasoline to improve its anti-detonation characteristics. Articulating rod. See link rod. Aspect ratio. The ratio of the length of an airfoil, such as a compressor blade, to its width. Asymmetrical loading. The loading of a propeller disc that causes one side to produce more thrust than the other side. ATF. Aerodynamic twisting force. The aerodynamic force that acts on a rotating propeller blade to increase its blade angle. The axis of rotation of a blade is near the center of its cord line, and the center of pressure is between the axis and the leading edge. Aerodynamic lift acting through the center of pressure tries to rotate the blade to a higher pitch angle. Atomize. The process of breaking a liquid down into tiny droplets or a fine spray. Atomized liquids vaporize easily. Augmenter tube. A long, specially shaped stainless steel tube mounted around the exhaust tail pipe of a reciprocating engine. As exhaust gases flow through the augmenter tube, they produce a low pressure in the engine compartment that draws in cooling air through the cylinder fins. Automatic intake valve. An intake valve opened by low pressure created inside the cylinder as the piston moves down. There is no mechanical means of opening it. Automatic mixture control. AMC. The device in a fuel metering system, such as a carburetor or fuel injection system, that keeps the fuel air mixture ratio constant as the density of air changes with altitude. Autosyn system. The registered trade name of the remote indicating instrument system. An autosyn system uses an electromagnet rotor, excited with 400 Hz AC, and a three-phase distributed pole stator. Axial bearing load. The load on a bearing parallel to the shaft on which the bearing is mounted. Thrust produces an axial load on a bearing. Axial turbine. A turbine that is turned by a fluid flowing through it in a direction that is approximately parallel to the shaft on which the turbine wheel is mounted. Axial flow compressor. A type of compressor used in gas turbine engines. Air passes through the compressor in essentially a straight line, parallel to the axis of the compressor. The compressor is made of a number of stages of rotating compressor blades between stages of stationary stator vanes. Axis of rotation. The center line about which a propeller rotates. Babbit. A soft silvery metal used for main bearing inserts in aircraft reciprocating engines. Babbit is made of tin with small amounts of copper and antimony. Back. Propeller nomenclature. The curved surface of a propeller blade. The back of a propeller blade corresponds to the upper surface of an airplane wing. Back suction mixture control. A type of mixture control used in some float carburetors that regulates the fuel air mixture by varying the air pressure above the fuel in the float bowl. G3. Baffle. 
A thin sheet metal shroud or bulkhead used to direct the flow of cooling air between and around the cylinder fins of an air-cooled reciprocating engine. Bayonet stack. An exhaust stack with an elongated and flattened end. The gases leave the stack through a slot perpendicular to its length. Bayonet stacks decrease both exhaust back pressure and noise. PDC. Bottom dead center. The position of a piston in a reciprocating engine, when the piston is at the bottom of its stroke, and the wrist pin, crank pin, and center of the crankshaft are all in line. Bell mouth. The shape of the inlet of an augmenter tube that forms a smooth converging duct. The bell mouth shape allows the maximum amount of air to be drawn into the tube. Bell mouth inlet duct. A form of convergent inlet air duct used to direct air into the compressor of a gas turbine engine. It is extremely efficient, and is used where there is little ramp pressure available to force air into the engine. Bell mouth ducts are used in engine test cells, and on engines installed in helicopters. Benzene. A colorless, volatile, flammable, aromatic hydrocarbon liquid which has the chemical formula C6H6. Benzene, which is sometimes called benz oil, is used as a solvent, a cleaning fluid, and a fuel for some special types of reciprocating engines. Bernoulli's principle. A physical principle that explains the relationship between kinetic and potential energy in a stream of moving fluid. When energy is neither added to, nor taken from the fluid, any increase in its velocity, kinetic energy, will result in a corresponding decrease in its pressure, potential energy. Beta control range, beta mode. The range of operation of a turboprop power plant used for in-flight approach and ground handling of the engine and aircraft. Typically, the beta mode includes operations from 65% to 95% of the engine's rated RPM. Beta tube. A tube in a Gerus TPE-331 turboprop power plant that extends into the propeller pitch control to act as a follow-up device. It provides movement of the propeller blades in proportion to movement of the power lever. Bazel. The rim which holds the glass cover in the case of an aircraft instrument. BHP. Brake horsepower. The actual horsepower delivered to the propeller shaft of the reciprocating or turboprop engine. Bidirectional fibers. Fibers in a piece of composite material arranged to sustain loads in two directions. Bimetallic hairspring. A flat, spiral wound spring made of two strips of metal laid side by side and welded together. The two metals have different coefficients of expansion. And as the temperature changes, the spiral either tightens or loosens. A bimetallic hair spring is used in a thermocouple temperature changes at the reference junction. Bimetallic strip. A metal strip made of two different types of metal fastened together side by side. When heated, the two metals expand different amounts and the strip warps or bends. Bite. Built-in test equipment. A troubleshooting system installed in many modern jet aircraft. Bite equipment monitors engine and airframe systems. And when a fault is found, isolates it and provides maintenance personnel with a code that identifies the LaRue line replaceable unit that contains the fault. Blade. The component of a propeller that converts the rotation of the propeller shaft into thrust. The blade of a propeller corresponds to the wing of an airplane. Blade angle. The acute angle between the cord line of a propeller blade and the plane of rotation. Blade butt. The end of a propeller blade that fits into the hub. Blade root. The ridges or upset portion of a propeller blade that holds it in the hub. Blade shank. The rounded portion of a propeller blade between the root and the airfoil section. Blade station. A reference position on a propeller blade that is a specified number of inches from the center of the propeller hub. Blade tip. The opposite end from the root of a propeller blade. Blending. A method of repairing damaged compressor and turbine blades. The damage is removed and the area is cleaned out with a fine file to form a shallow depression with generous radii. The file marks are then removed with a fine abrasive stone so the surface of the repaired area will match the surface of the rest of the blade. G4. Blisk. A turbine wheel machined from a single slab of steel. The disc and blades are an integral unit. Blow in doors. Spring-loaded doors in the inlet duct of some turbojet or turbofan engine installations that are opened by differential air pressure when inlet air pressure drops below that of the ambient air. Air flowing through the doors adds to the normal inlet air passing through the engine, and helps prevent compressor stall. Bluckets. The portions of aft fan blades that are in the exhaust of the core engine. Bluckets drive the fan from energy received from hot gases leaving the core engine. BMEP. Brake mean effective pressure. The average pressure inside the cylinder of a reciprocating engine during the power stroke. BMEP. Measured in pounds per square inch. Relates to the torque produced by the engine, and can be calculated when you know the brake horsepower. Boost. A term for manifold pressure that has been increased above the ambient atmospheric pressure by a supercharger. Bootstrapping. An action that is self-initiating or self-sustaining. In a turbocharger system, bootstrapping describes a transient increase in engine power that causes the turbocharger to speed up, which in turn causes the engine to produce more power. Bore. The diameter of a reciprocating engine cylinder. Boroscope. An inspection tool for viewing the inside of a turbine engine without disassembling it. The instrument consists of a light, mirror, and magnifying lens mounted inside a small diameter tube that is inserted into a turbine engine through baroscope inspection ports. Boss. An enlarged area in a casting or machined part. A boss provides additional strength to the part where holes for mounting or attaching parts are drilled. Bottom. Verb. A condition in the installation of a propeller on a splint shaft when either the front or rear cone contacts an obstruction that prevents the cone from properly seating inside the propeller hub. 
Burton tube. The major component in a gauge pressure measuring instrument. It is a thin wall metal tube that has an elliptical cross section and is formed into a curve. One end of the tube is sealed and connected to an arm that moves the pointer across the instrument dial, and the open end is anchored to the instrument case. The pressure to be measured is directed into the open end, which causes the elliptical cross section to become more circular. As the cross section changes, the curve straightens and moves the pointer over the dial by an amount proportional to the amount of pressure. Brayton cycle. The constant pressure cycle of energy transformation used by gas turbine engines. Fuel is sprayed into the air passing through the engine and burned. Heat from the burning fuel air mixture expands the air and accelerates it as it moves through the engine. The Brayton cycle is an open cycle in that the intake, compression, combustion, expansion, and exhaust events all take place at the same time, but in different locations within the engine. British Thermal Unit, 2. The basic unit of heat energy in the English system. 1 2 is the amount of heat energy needed to raise the temperature of 1 pound of pure water from 60 degrees Fahrenheit to 61 degrees Fahrenheit. BSFC. Brake specific fuel consumption. A measure of the amount of fuel used for a given amount of power produced by a heat engine. BSFC is expressed in pounds of fuel burned per hour for each brake horsepower the engine is producing. Bungee cord. An elastic cord made of small strips of rubber encased in a loosely braided cloth tube that holds and protects the rubber, yet allows it to stretch. The energy in a stretched bungee cord may be used to crank a large aircraft engine. Burner. See combustor. Burnish. To smooth the surface of a metal part that has been damaged by a deep scratch or gouge. Metal piled at the edge of the damage is pushed back into the damage with a smooth, hard steel burnishing tool. Butterfly valve. A flat, disc-shaped valve used to control the flow of fluid in a round pipe or tube. When the butterfly valve is across the tube, the flow is shut off, and when it is parallel with the tube, the obstruction caused by the valve is minimum, and the flow is at its greatest. Butterfly tight throttle valves are used to control the airflow through the fuel metering system. Bypass engine. Another name for a turbofan engine. See turbofan engine. Bypass ratio. The ratio of the mass of air moved by the fan to the mass of air moved by the core engine. Calendar month. The measurement of time used by the FAA for inspection and certification purposes. One calendar month from a given date extends from that date until midnight of the last day of that month. G5. Cam. An eccentric, or lobe, on a rotating shaft that changes rotary motion into linear motion. A cam is mounted on the magnet shaft in a magneto to push upward on the insulated breaker point to separate, or open, the points when the magnet is in a particular location. Cam engine. A reciprocating engine with axial cylinders arranged around a central shaft. Rollers on the pistons in the cylinders press against a sinusoidal cam mounted on the shaft to produce rotation of the shaft. Cam ground piston. A reciprocating engine piston that is not round, but is ground so that its diameter parallel to the wrist pin is slightly smaller than its diameter perpendicular to the pin. The mass of metal used in the wrist pin boss, the enlarged area around the wrist pin hole, expands when heated, and when the piston is at its operating temperature, it is perfectly round. Can annular combustor. A type of combustor used in some large turbojet and turbofan engines. It consists of individual cans into which fuel is sprayed and ignited. These cans mount on an annular duct which collects the hot gases and directs them uniformly into the turbine. Capacitance after firing. The continuation of the spark across the gap in a shielded spark plug after the fuel-air mixture in the cylinder is ignited. After firing is caused by the return of electrical energy stored in the capacitance of the shielded ignition leads. Capacitance after firing is eliminated by the use of a resistor in the spark plug. Capacitor. An electrical component, formerly called a condenser, that consists of two large aerial conductors, called plates, separated by an insulator. Electrons stored on one of the plates produces an electrostatic pressure difference between the plates. Capillary tube. A glass or metal tube with a tiny inside diameter. Capillary action causes the fluid to move within the tube. Carbon pile voltage regulator. A voltage regulator for a high output DC generator that uses a stack of pure carbon discs for the variable resistance element. A spring holds pressure on the stack to reduce its resistance when the generator output voltage is low. This allows maximum field current to flow. The field from an electromagnet, whose strength varies directly with the generator voltage, opposes the spring to loosen the stack and increase its resistance when the generator voltage needs to be decreased. The increased resistance decreases the field current and reduces the output voltage. Carbon track. A trail of carbon deposited by an arc across a high voltage component such as a distributor block. Carbon tracks have a relatively low resistance to the high voltage, and can cause misfiring and loss of engine power. Cartridge starter. A self-contained starter used on some military aircraft. A cartridge similar in size to a shotgun shell is ignited in the starter breech. The expanding gases drive a piston attached to a helical spline that converts the linear movement of the piston into rotary motion to rotate the crankshaft. Cascade effect. The cumulative effect that occurs when the output of one series of components serves as the input to the next series. Catalyst. A substance used to change the speed, or rate, of a chemical action without being chemically changed itself. Cavitating. The creation of low pressure in an oil pump, when the inlet system is not able to supply all of the oil the pump requires. Prolonged cavitation can damage pump components. Center of pressure. 
the point on the cord line of an airfoil where all aerodynamic forces are concentrated. Center line thrust airplane. A twin engine airplane with both engines mounted in the fuselage. One is installed as a tractor in the front of the cabin. The impenage is mounted on booms. Centrifugal compressor. A type of compressor that uses a van plate like impeller. Air is taken into the center, or eye, of the impeller and slung outward by centrifugal force into a diffuser, where its velocity is decreased and its pressure increased. Ceramic. Any of several hard, brittle, heat resistant, non corrosive materials made by shaping, and then firing a mineral, such as clay, at a high temperature. Channel chrome cylinders. Reciprocating engine cylinders with hard chromium plated walls. The surface of this chrome plating forms a spider web of tiny stress cracks. Deplating current enlarges the cracks and forms channels that hold lubricating oil on the cylinder wall. Cheek, crankshaft. The offset portion of a crankshaft that connects the crank pin to the main bearing journals. G6. Chip protector. A component in a lubrication system that attracts and holds ferrous metal chips circulating with the engine oil. Some chip protectors are part of an electrical circuit. When metal particles short across the two contacts in the protector, the circuit is completed, and an enunciator light is turned on to inform the flight crew that metal particles are loose in the lubrication system. Choke of a cylinder. The difference in the bar diameter of a reciprocating engine cylinder in the area of the head, and in the center of the barrel. Choke ground cylinder. A cylinder of a reciprocating engine that is ground, so that its diameter at the top of the barrel is slightly smaller than the diameter in the center of the stroke. The large mass of metal in the cylinder head absorbs enough heat to cause the top end of the barrel to expand more than the rest of the barrel. At normal operating temperature, the diameter of a choke ground cylinder is uniform throughout. Choke nozzle. A nozzle in a gas turbine engine that limits the speed of gases flowing through it. The gases accelerate until they reach the speed of sound, and a normal shock wave forms that prevents further acceleration. Cord line. An imaginary line, passing through a propeller blade, joining the leading and trailing edges. Cigarette. A commonly used name for a spark plug terminal connector used with a shielded spark plug. Circular magnetism. A method of magnetizing a part for magnetic particle inspection. Current is passed through the part, and the lines of magnetic flux surround it. Circular magnetism makes it possible to detect faults that extend lengthwise through the part. Circumferential coil spring, garter spring. A coil spring formed into a ring. This type of spring is used to hold segmented ring type carbon seals tightly against a rotating shaft. Claret red. A dark purplish pink to a dark gray purplish red color. Classifier. A fire with solid combustible materials such as wood, paper, and cloth as its fuel. Class B fire. A fire that has combustible liquids as its fuel. Class C fire. A fire which involves energized electrical equipment. Class D fire. A fire in which a metal such as magnesium burns. Closed loop control. A type of control in which part of the output is fed back to the input. This allows the input to continually compare the command signals with the output to determine the extent to which the commands have been complied with. Coke. The solid carbon residue left when all volatile parts of a mineral oil have been evaporated by heat. Cold cranking simulation. A method used for specifying the characteristics of a lubricating oil at low temperature. Oils rated by this test have the letter W, standing for winter, in their designation. For example, C15W50. Cold section. The portion of a gas turbine engine ahead of the combustion section. The cold section includes the inlet, compressor, and diffuser. Cold tank lubrication system. A turbine engine lubricating system in which the oil cooler is in the scavenge subsystem. Collector ring. A ring made of thin corrosion-resistant steel tubing that encircles a radial engine and collects exhaust gases from each cylinder. The ring ends with a connection to the exhaust tail pipe. Combustor. Combustion chamber. The section of a gas turbine engine in which fuel is injected. This fuel mixes with air from the compressor and burns. The intense heat from the combustion expands the air flowing through the combustor and directs it out through the turbine. Combustors are also called burners. Commutator. A mechanical rectifier mounted on the armature shaft of a DC generator or motor. It consists of a cylindrical arrangement of insulated copper bars connected to the armature coils. Carbon brushes right on the copper bars to carry current into or out of the commutator, providing a unidirectional current from a generator or a reversal of current in the motor coils. Compensating winding. A series winding in a compound wound DC generator. The compensating windings are embedded in the faces of the field poles, and their varying magnetic field works with the fields from the interpoles to effectively cancel the field distortion caused by armature current. G7. Composite propeller blade. A propeller blade made from several materials such as metal, graphite, glass or aramid fibers, and foam. Compression ratio, reciprocating engine. The ratio of the volume of a cylinder of a reciprocating engine with the piston at the bottom of its stroke engine to the volume of the cylinder with the piston at the top of its stroke. Compression ratio, turbine engine. The ratio of the pressure of the air at the discharge of a turbine engine compressor to the pressure of the air at its inlet. Compressor bleed air. Air that is tapped off from a turbine engine compressor. Compressor bleed air is used for antacing the inlet ducts, and for cooling the turbine inlet guide vanes and first stage turbine blades. Bleed air is also used for certain airframe functions. See customer bleed air. Compressor pressure ratio. See compression ratio, turbine engine.
Compressor stall. A condition in the turbine engine axial flow compressor in which the angle of attack of one or more blades is excessive and the smooth airflow through the compressor is disrupted. Compressor surge. A stall that affects the entire compressor and seriously restricts the airflow through the engine. Condi ducts. The British name for a convergent divergent duct. See convergent divergent duct. Condenser. See capacitor. Contact. The term used between a person hand propping an aircraft engine and the person in the flight deck. When the person is ready to spin the propeller, he calls contact. The person in the flight deck turns on the fuel, slightly opens the throttle, applies the brakes, and replies contact, and then turns the ignition switch to both. The propeller is then pulled through to start the engine. Constant displacement pump. A fluid pump that moves a specific volume of fluid each time it rotates. Constant pressure cycle of energy release. The cycle of energy transformation of a gas turbine engine. See Brayton cycle. Constant volume cycle of energy release. The cycle of energy transformation of a reciprocating engine. See auto cycle. Continuous magnetic particle inspection. A method of magnetic particle inspection in which the part is inspected by flowing a fluid containing particles of iron oxide over the part, while the magnetizing current is flowing. Contrarotating. Rotating in opposite directions. Turbine rotors are contrarotating when the different stages have a common center, but turn in opposite directions. Convergent divergent duct. A duct that has a decreasing cross section in the direction of flow, convergent until a minimum area is reached. After this point, the cross section increases. Divergent. Convergent divergent ducts are called CD ducts or condi ducts. Convergent duct. A duct that has a decreasing cross section in the direction of flow. Core engine. The gas generator portion of a turboshaft, turboprop, or turbofan engine. The core engine consists of the portion of the compressor used to supply air for the engine operation, diffuser, combustors, and turbines used to drive the compressor. The core engine provides the high velocity gas to drive the fan, and or any free turbines that provide power for propellers, rotors, pumps, or generators. Cowling. The removable cover that encloses an aircraft engine. Crankcase. The housing that encloses the crankshaft, camshaft, and many of the accessory drive gears of a reciprocating engine. The cylinders are mounted on the crankcase, and the engine attaches to the airframe by the crankcase. Crankshaft. The central component of a reciprocating engine. This high-strength alloy steel shaft has hardened and polished bearing surfaces that ride in bearings in the crankcase. Offset throws. Formed on the crankshaft, have ground and polished surfaces on which the connecting rods ride. The connecting rods change the in and out motion of the pistons into rotation of the crankshaft. Creep. The deformation of a metal part that is continually exposed to high centrifugal loads and temperatures. Critical altitude. The altitude above which a reciprocating engine will no longer produce its rated horsepower with its throttle wide open. Critical engine. The engine of a twin engine airplane, whose loss would cause the greatest yawing effect. G8. Critical match number. The flight match number at which there is the first indication of air flowing over any part of the structure at a speed of Mach 1. The local speed of sound. CRT. Cathode ray tube. An electronic display tube in which a stream of electrons is attracted to the charged inner surface of the tube face. Acceleration grids and inner surface of the tube face. Acceleration grids and focusing grids speed the movement of the electrons and shape the beam to a pinpoint size. Electrostatic or electromagnetic forces caused by deflection plates or coils move the beam over the face of the tube. The inside of the tube face is treated with a phosphor material that emits light when the electrons strike it. Cryogenic fluid. A liquid which boils at a temperature lower than about 110 superscript OK-163 OK, superscript OC under normal atmospheric pressure. CSD. Constant speed drive. A component used with either aircraft gas turbine or reciprocating engines to drive AC generators. The speed of the output shaft of the CSD is held constant, while the speed of its input shaft carries. The CSD holds the speed of the generator, and the frequency of the AC constant as the engine speed varies through its normal operating range. CTF. Centrifugal twisting force. The force acting about the longitudinal axis of a propeller blade, and which tries to rotate the blade to a low pitch angle. As the propeller rotates, centrifugal force tries to flatten the blade so all of its mass rotates in the same plane. Curtis Jenny. Curtis JN4D. A World War I training airplane powered by a Curtis Ox 5 engine. It was widely available after the war, and helped introduce aviation to the general public. Customer bleed air. Air that is tapped off a turbine engine compressor, and used for such airframe functions as the operation of air conditioning and pressurization systems. Cylinder. The component of the reciprocating engine which houses the piston, valves, and spark plugs and forms the combustion chamber. Data. The input for computer processing in the form of numerical information that represents characters or analog quantities. Dad plate specifications. Specification of each gas turbine engine determined in the manufacturer's test cell, when the engine was calibrated. This data includes the engine serial. Number with the upper that produced a specific RPM. The technician refers to this information, when trimming the engine. Dad plate performance. The performance specifications of a turbine engine observed and recorded by the engine manufacturer or overhauler, and recorded on the engine dad plate.
This data includes the engine speed at which a specified error is attained. When trimming the engine, the technician uses this data as the goal. DC. Direct current. Electrical current in which the electrons always flow in the same direction. The aerator. A component in a turbine engine lubrication system that removes air from the scavenged oil before it is returned to the tank. Deceleration. The amount of velocity of an object, measured in feet per second, is decreased by a force during each second it is acted upon by that force. Deceleration is usually expressed in terms of feet per second. Per second. FPS squared. The Haviland DH4. An English-designed observation airplane built in large quantities in the United States during World War I. After the war, surplus DH-4 seconds were used for carrying the U.S. mail. Deasing. The removal of ice that has formed on a surface. Density altitude. The altitude in standard air at which the density is the same as that of the existing air. Detergent oil. A type of mineral oil with metallic ash-forming additives that protects the inside of an engine from sludge and varnish buildup. Used in automotive engines. It has proven unsuitable for use in aircraft engines. Detonation. An uncontrolled explosion inside the cylinder of a reciprocating engine. Detonation occurs when the pressure and temperature of the fuel inside the cylinder exceeds the critical pressure and temperature of the fuel. Detonation may be caused by using fuel that has a lower octane rating or performance number than is specified for the engine. Dewar bottle. A special container used to store liquid oxygen and liquid nitrogen. A Dewar bottle has an inner and an outer container, and the space between them forms a vacuum. The two surfaces within the vacuum are silver to reflect heat away from the container walls. Differential pressure. A single pressure that is the difference between two opposing pressures. G9. Diffuser. A component in a gas turbine engine that decreases the velocity of air flowing through it and increases its pressure. Digitized image. A modified image picked up by the miniature TV camera in the end of a fiber optic probe. This image is converted into a digital electronic signal that eliminates unwanted portions of the viewed area and allows the desired image to be enhanced for a clearer view of the inside of a turbine engine. Dipstick. A gauge. In the form of a thin metal rod, used to measure the level of liquid in a reservoir. The dipstick is pushed into the reservoir until it contacts a built-in stop. Then it is removed and visually inspected. The level of liquid in the reservoir is indicated by the amount of the dipstick wet by the liquid. Dirigible. A large, cigar-shaped, lighter-than-air flying machine. Dirigibles differ from balloons in that they are powered and can be steered. Distributed pull stator winding. Alternator stator windings wound in a series of slots in the stator frame. A distributed pull stator is distinguished from a salient pull stator whose coils are wound around separate pull shoes that project inward from the field frame toward the rotor. Distributor. A high-voltage selector switch that is geared even from the shaft of the rotating magnet in a magneto. The distributor rotor picks up the high voltage from the secondary winding of the coil and directs it to high-voltage terminals. From here, it is carried by high-tension ignition leads to the spark plugs. Divergent duct. A duct that has an increased cross-sectional area in the direction of flow. Downdraft carburetor. A carburetor that mounts on the top of a reciprocating engine. Air entering the engine flows downward through the carburetor. Increment P, delta P. Differential pressure. Droop. A progressive decrease in rapport with load in a gas turbine engine, whose speed is governed with a flyway type governor in the fuel control. As the load increases, the pilot valve drops down to meter more fuel. The lower position of the valve decreases the compression of the speeder spring and allows the flyweights to assume an on-speed position at a lower RPM. Dry sump engine. An engine that carries its lubricating oil supply in a tank external to the engine. Dual ignition. An ignition system of an aircraft reciprocating engine that has two of every critical unit, including two spark plugs in each cylinder. Dual ignition provides safety in the event of one system malfunctioning, but more important, igniting the fuel-air mixture inside the cylinder at two locations provides more efficient combustion of the fuel-air mixture in the cylinder. Dual spool gas turbine engine. An axial flow turbine engine that has two compressors, each driven by its own stage or stages of turbines. Duct heater. A thrust augmentation system, similar to an afterburner, where fuel is added to the fan discharge air and burned. Duct losses. A decrease in pressure of the air flowing into a gas turbine engine caused by friction. Durability. A measure of engine life. Durability is usually measured in TBO hours. Duty cycle. A schedule that allows a device to operate for a given period of time, followed by a cooling down period before the device can be operated again. Dwell chamber. A chamber in a turbine engine into which the scavenged oil is returned. Entrained air separates from the oil in the dwell chamber before it is picked up by the pressure pump. Dynamometer. A device used to measure the amount of torque being produced by an engine. The drive shaft of the engine is loaded with either an electric generator or a fluid pump and the output of the generator or pump is measured and converted into units of torque. Torque at a specific RPM can be converted into brake horsepower. Dyne. The unit of force that imparts an acceleration of 1 cm per second. Per second to a mass of 1 gram. 1 dyne is equal to 2.248 middle.10-6 pounds. Eddy current. Current induced into a conductor due to a mobbing, or non-uniform magnetic field. EEC. Electronic engine control. An electronic fuel control for a gas turbine engine. The EEC senses the power lever angle, plot. Engine RPM, bleed valve, and variable stator vane position. 
and the various engine pressures and temperatures. It meters the correct amount of fuel to the nozzles for all flight conditions to prevent turbine overspeed and overtemperature. G10